The aesthetic already is super clean. Just, just the UI is super, super clean. How does one interact? Do I need a controller? Uh, let me grab my controller. Oh, the Xbox controller appeared to work. Perfect. Ooh. You freaking schlumber, dude. The watercolor art style is super pretty. Oh, we broke it. Oh, we did break it. We can't sing anymore. Oh! Oh, we're dead. We broke something in the first 30 minutes. Like the first 30 seconds. Okay, so we lost the ability to sing. The statue that we were on broke. I assume a statue. And we fell through the heavens and survive. The art style is super cool. Apparently A is fall over um, <laughs> in despair. Apparently B is also fall over in despair. Oh, we're set. Oh, yes! Oh, we can now run. Oh. So is this the statue? We gain the ability to run and jump. Oh, so this is solid. No fall damage. Guys, that is a good thing to know. The block is moving. Wait, 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 friend. B is sing, but it doesn't look like we can. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, but just... <laughs> so yeah, we can't sing. Somehow we've lost the ability to sing. Things seem to be really ruined. So, you know, it's games like this that really question, like, what happened? Why are we here? Why are we the only one? How did everything fall to ruin? Did this all just happen, like we just saw? Or is this the result of some ancient calamity? And, you know... That's it, the, the game has to impart on us. Little Navi sprite. Got a little constellation friend. The fact the only color so far has been our hair has been very interesting. But it really, you know, imparts on us the, the, the aesthetic choices. Like we are the only color right now. Pretty things make me tear up. Oh, I'm missing a node. Got it, so I need one, I need at least one more. Cool, pretty. Again, what does this all mean? What are little constellation friends? Oh, there's one up there. Hear the burb, she's mad. She's always mad, dude. <gasps> Scale the tower. I thought I could jump on that. Thank goodness. <laughs> What I do, but I thought I could jump on the like sheep bird, and it did. I fell right through it. Oh, I made a joke like they were constellation friends, but they are actually constellation friends. Oh, thanks, guys. On the little sound effect when you're running on them is so cool. So, do we keep constellation friends? It appears so. So I wonder how many we will have by the end of this. Oh. So the first instance of color, other than our hair, being red, and so the red on the, the, the fingers and the red in the sky, it and the fact that, you know, it looked like she was crying, would lead me to believe that the whatever happened recently was really bad and that it was recent it was violent uh is this the node that we entered last time so we are missing one more node oh so we need more con constellation friends to make a path up back up to the sky. Again, the, the red juxtaposes our hair 
a lot. I hope we come back to that area because it looks like we need to. Yeah, the, the river, the waterfalls of red, not a good sign. What happened? Why is everything in ruin? How are we alive? What are we? Who are we? Where's the sun? Solaire. Crack open a cold with the boys. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Signs of civilization. This is the first unruined stuff we've seen. The propellers are stationary, though. Oh, I lied. Oh, sandstorm. Okay, the sandstorm is bad. So maybe a, a, a giant storm came through the area? Are we on Tatooine? It kind of looks like it. Oh, the, the turbines tell me how close a storm is. That is such a cute little detail. Yeah, it seems like these storms are frequent and volatile. So maybe there was some great storm that came through and destroyed the civilization, who knows? Rock friend. It seems that they were at least technologically advanced enough to utilize wind turbines. But yeah, this, this world is broken. We're on a giant rock friend. That is one big bug. Yeah, I mean, it doesn't seem hostile. It just seems big. I like the level design, it's very pretty. It is very unique. I mean, I'm curious to see what they do next. Huh. How do I get this one? So it reacts when I step on it. Is There must be like a butt slam or something, right? It doesn't look like I can access this right now. Or just more broken tech. Like lamp posts or something. So the constellations. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just, I just hold X. Yo, we've got Kirby down B. Boys! <laughs> and we can walk around as a little blocky. Oh, that's so cute. Me when I eat the crafting table. It makes me immune to the storm. Interesting. I was curious if it would allow me to, to, to weigh out the storm. That's so cool. This area looks like a war zone. It really does. It looks like nuclear winter. It looks like there's just nothing left. So more statues. So this must be like the goddess that the civilization worshiped. I wanna know what these rock creatures are. I mean, they might just be like um, hermit crabs. They might just be creatures that need the stonework to survive. What did we learn about digging straight down, boys? Uh-oh. Why do they have butterflies and we don't? <gasps> we can break pots. Smash ancient. Oh. oh, we made it mad. Oh, did we disrespect archeology span too much and we made it mad? Cute little windmills. So that not everything is destroyed, which is good. Can I make that jump? Oh. Yeah, it just extended out towards me. Wonderful. Thank you, Bridge. So this looks like the temple we were just in, but I doubt it. I'm gonna refrain from crushing any rock friends. I need f four. Ooh, 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 what's this? What? Well, now it feels like I have to break those. I don't know why crushing these feels important because one of them was hidden, you feel me? So I'm curious if that means that knocking them over is somehow important, but I'm gonna refrain from hurting rock friends. Um, so we need to booty slam this. It's so like a clock? So it'll make half of it for us. Oh, but we need a third to go over that way. Understood. Huh. Then what do I do? So this doesn't appear to be... 
Oh, 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 it tilts. Ah! Got it. Good little, good little hint, good little indication. The sound effect really helped me there. Oh, 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 if I reset this, I can access the other jump. Thank goodness this whole thing didn't just collapse on top of us. Cute. We made it. We're so good. Kind of look like the mass of a ship. Ooh, and the, the red sails could be like solar sails, like in um Treasure Planet. I like the I like where your head is at, Bridge. So interesting. What this tells us is that the gravitation on this planet is fucked. Because we just exploded these out and they got suspended. Oh, it extended! I'm so smart! My brain! It's like that episode of Spongebob where he's sick! <laughs> uh, dead center? Yeah! So this appears to be the inner mechanisms of a clock. I love me a good explore. Let's just jump down here and see. Oh, 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 it is bra- this can be broken. Oh, will I weigh it down? That'd be really cool if I do. Yep. I weigh it down. Dude, that's so sick. Beautiful. I'm trying to find out the lore by visuals alone. I think that's the issue is that we don't know enough. Like they, they clearly were technologically advanced to have hot air balloons. You know, they had stone cutting and bells and clockwork. But like, what happened to them? I, I think it had something to do with the storm. Found another one. I really hope we haven't missed one. I love, I love collecting things. Oh, I'm one shy. No, I don't want to break rock, friend. Fuck. Oh. It's a construct. Oh. Thank you. Thank you for helping me after I just destroyed your home. So cool. So pretty. So we don't need a slide ability. Which is what I thought we did. But it's cool. I don't know why I'm breaking those, but it feels right. I'm glad Rock Friend survived. I would have been completely distraught had Rock Friend died. Break the stone. I, my intuition was correct. I, <laughs> it felt like it was something I needed to do and it was, so here we go. So is this a turbine or a clock? I am not heavy enough. Huh, can I drop from higher? Can I potentially get on top of it? Oh, maybe. Maybe, I might be right. Yeah, 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 look, look, look. Oh, I'm so smart! Body slam! That still wasn't enough. Oh yeah, I can just climb up further. That's so cool, dude. And now I body slam. Physics, bitch! Wait, did we just lift the city? It wasn't a turbine. It was a crank. This is a pulley. And so, you know, this, you can see that the, the crank is at least damaged because there were rungs that we could jump through. So even the, the intact machinery is not unmarred. So another hand statue. We now have green. A color has been brought back. So, out of the storm came life? So, are we restoring the planet after some great cataclysm? Are we God? So now there's life on this planet. Now we're, we've got blues and greens. Oh, is this the same dungeon? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, we've, we've restored life. Oh no, we missed one. Turtle? Oh, so these must be the levels. Oh yeah, yeah, look, the, the iconography looks like the, the, the crank. So we missed one in the city. That means we missed one in the ruins. I'm assuming this means ruins over here. How many are here? There's five. So we're looking for five on the turtle. There's another seven in the tree. Uh-oh. So the red is clearly a destructive force. Because the butterflies are red and they just 
are breaking shit. They also attacked us in the dungeon, right? This game makes me want to attempt a watercolor type coloring. Do it. Oh, hello, friends. Little guys, yeah. We love a good little creature. Just walk around it, dude. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> Friend. Person? Yeah, that's a that's a sentient creature, it appears to be. Ah, so if it changes while I'm inside of it, I mean, it just spits me out. Cool. That's a, that's a cute little platforming section. I like that a lot. I love the folding textures. Like they just, it looks like, like a tablecloth or a piece of paper. Oh, that's a cute little platforming section. The fact that you have to re-jump to the back to the middle, that was dope as fuck. Fruit. Friend! We have a friend. Look, I'm shaped like you. Oh, he's shy. Oh, another fruit. Got it. There you go, friend. Yay! Friend! It feels like I can get down here, so I'm gonna try. Oh, yeah, yeah, there was an extra apple. So that's definitely an achievement to get him extra apples. Oh, he jumps when I jump. Got it. Cat, you drew me creatures. I need to see them. Yay! Little creature friends. Oh shit, he's got a Kirby down special too. Nice. Buff little guys, yeah. Ah. We have to pound it together. He's just rolling down the hill like, help me, please. <laughs> you okay, homie? Yeah, you're fine. You're tough. Go back for the apple. Go back for the apple? Did I miss it? Well, we lost our friend. Oh, he didn't eat it. Son of a bitch. Because I jumped up here and he did. Oh, because I didn't collect him. That's why. Oh, feed the forest friend. Hell yeah. Dude, what a cute fucking game. Dude, we've only found one of those nodes. There were se there are seven on this mission. Did something for you? Okay, I have to look. Hell yeah. I love this. Cat, please post that to image gallery. Oh, I need nodes. But that's a new power. That's where we got Kirby down smash. Oh, I fell down. Oh, these are friends. He waved! Oh my god, it's so cute. Oh my god, they're so nice. Hello! Hi! Hello! Hi! <gasps> Friend! <laughs> oh, thank you for sharing your little pip. I'm gonna sob. <laughs> okay, so we learned something. The red trees alternate on a jump. Interesting. So each one's technically a blind jump because we have to we have to know the mechanic for it to just be ahead of us. So cool. Okay, so that's two. What new power do we unlock? Oh, super jump. Oh, it's it's not a super jump. It's a glide. Oh, it is a bit of a second jump, though. The cape is like wings. Yeah. Oh, and I can super jump off of those. Huh. So now the, the red butterflies are helping us. <gasps> I saw it move. I explored, guys. I used my brain. But yeah, the movement just feels so nice. And I can just... Oh, did I fuck that up? Oh, do I need to jump cancel later? So like, fall, jump, and then glide. Yeah, I do. 
Very cool. That's sick. Oh, they shift around. Got it. So I need to jump into them. So like, now? Yeah. And then as they're falling, oh! That was dope. I bet there was something in that room though. And I missed it. Oh, can I get back down? Yes! So it's one, two, three. Beautiful. Not even close. Interesting. This is much, much different in reverse. What? Oh, okay, so you can just kind of air stall long enough over there. Nice. Beautiful. Oh, that's so slick. The butterflies are black now. What happened to them? Uh-oh. Bird? Boss fight? Bro, I wasn't expecting a boss fight. Oh, I need to use the, um, thickening. <clears throat> we are thick. Oh. That was cool. So this is five, I believe. Oh, that's actually a hard jump. So I think I need to retain my second jump. Oh, if you bounce off both of them... Got it. So what I did there is if you bounce from one to the next in quick succession, you actually maintain momentum. Okay, where, where did the birdie go? Oh. Oh, I bet what's going to happen is I'm going to have to use its scream to get a super jump. Oh, I have to be midair. Got it. Got it, got it, got it. So... To make this work, you must already be mid-air or it staggers you. There we go. Uh-oh! It doesn't like the bells? So I gotta get to the butterf- Oh, I'm stupid. I am too thick for you. Maybe I just need to get across to it so it blows really hard. I don't know. Yes. For a moment it had a face. Did you guys see that? Weird. That was weird. It was weird. I wonder why the, why the bird attacked us. So notably, the goddess, or whatever this entity is, has long hair, and we have short hair. Ooh, we have blue now. So we had like blues and greens, but now we have like deep blue and purple. The music is giving me hardcore Avatar The Last Airbender vibes. <gasps> Sploosh! Oh, the trees are leaking. Oh, the water completely borks our jump. Yo, you gotta go a long way without falling. Yeah, you gotta go a long way without falling to get that little node right there. You see that? Oh. I don't know if I could have made that. No, that does not look like I can make it. Oh, I had an extra jump! I was gliding, but I bet that resets your jump. Hold on, hold on, hold on. If it does, that's super clean. Super clean. I love me a good platform with clean mechanics. It does. I just tried it right there. It absolutely resets your jump. So we double jump here. Boost. At our peak, double jump again, and then glide. 
There we go. Super cool. That's so cool. So again, the world has changed. There's, there's life, there's water. So I'm assuming we didn't get everything up here. Yeah, we missed one. So I'm assuming the giant turtle is the water level. Oh, maybe this basin's filled with water now. Yeah! Fuck yeah! Little creatures. They look like they have little hats. I love that. Okay, so the higher up we are, the deeper in the water we go. Good to know. Oh, look at that. We got through the water. We're trying to figure out the lore. We believe that there was some great cataclysm and our character is some kind of deity. And they're trying to fix the planet. We restored dirt and dust to the world. We then restored plant life. We then restored water. And that order of operation seems very interesting to me. Because you would think that water would come before plant life. But who knows? Mushroom! Mushroom! <gasps> they jiggle when you pound them, boys! Guys, this is the greatest win. And so yeah, this, this civilization that we've clearly... That, that's clearly come to ruin was advanced enough to have pulleys and tur wind turbines and massive stone structures. Like, I don't, I don't know what happened to them. Like, rip and pepperoni. Hello, little friends. Oh, the, I need to get up higher. Develop past the resources, maybe nuclear fallout. We were, t I actually mentioned nuclear winter before, and that's absolutely a possibility in my head. But there's this deity that they keep, like showing this massive stone woman. And I don't know if we're the stone woman, but the, the characteristics are different. The deity has long hair and our character distinctly has short hair. Ooh, a new ability though. Uh, body? The only issue is I can't stand on it. Oh, can I make up a, a fat little dude? And then freeze. And now I have a platform? Oh, my brain! I know that's what the game wanted from me, but I'm, I'm pretty smart. So will it freeze midair? That's a hard, that's a tough timing. I like the idea of putting this here first and then jumping off of it, potentially getting a little bit more height. The timing is really hard. Fuck. Shoot. That's a... I mean, I can see why it's only one jump to get that little pip. Because it, it is a tight timing to make it at all useful. Oh! I don't need to. I can just... I can just stare away to heaven. Oh my god. That is so fucking clever. Oh, that's so cool. I was doing it the hard way. Well done, Levi. Well done. That's a sick little puzzle. That's a sick little puzzle. So maybe it needs to be stuck in the down position. Oh, oh, oh. So it needs to slam, but get stuck. So I need to freeze this. Freeze this. so that it can come up and then slam this, I bet. Oh my God! What a cool fucking game! You need to stall the machine. You need to get it, it stuck in a half state. Bro, that's so cool. Yippee! Yippee! Okay, what, what new ability do we have? I'm assuming it's swimming. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, we're a little man ray! Bro! That handles very nicely. This is so beautiful. Yeah, man, this is a this is an incredible game. I can see why it's so highly rated. Found one. 
See the nice what I the reason I noticed this is because the wall wasn't solid. You could see this little swooshy down here, which meant it was passable. So that's a good indication of things like this is solid because the wall is completely black, but the other one was not, which is a really good indication of a secret. I like it a lot. All right, well, we got a third pip. Ah, 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 you bitch! Get back here! Don't run from me! That is too dark for my, um, my liking. Um, so yeah, if, if you can donate, please do, uh, plant and cat the two, two of the people in chat right now helped donate combined, I think $350. Um, and I cannot express how much that means to me. How do I do that faster? Oh, <gasps> do I have to ground slam? Dude, the fact that we're still using the mechanics from before is so sick. Yes! Oh, that's so sick. I'm stuck. Oh, can I just loopies around this? Hell yeah. Okay, that wasn't so bad. What do I do? So these are the butterflies. Oh, can I float them up here and get a super jump over the gap? Yeah, I think so. So if I boost here, nice. So that's all six, yes? Yes. Smash. Oh, there's the turtle. Oh, got it. I couldn't have come down here. It would have been too dark anyway. That is, that's such good game design. Having the game be based around color and then have a, an area of complete darkness to kind of indicate to you this is the wrong way to go is so subtle, but so beautifully done. This, is, this game has a lot of very, very clever game design as well as clever aesthetics. Why did you stop? Hello? Oh, were you just getting me through that one section? Oh, oh, oh! I can go up the waterfall. That's cool. I like that a lot. That's so pretty. The moon! <laughs> oh! Are those... Are we repairing the ruins? Or are those just echoes of the ruins? Wow, what a pretty game. Yellow. Nice. Geocast Temple of the Gods. Oh! Uh, the bird's back. Don't make me get the bell! Oh, this is gonna be cool. Oh, it's an eel now. Ooh, a dark shapeshifter. Ooh, ah! I'm just trying to stay ahead of it. I don't think I chose that path. No, I'm, I'm not actively choosing. It's very pretty, but I'm not actively choosing these. Like, you see how much my character's moving? That is very minimal. Oh, that's so pretty. No, you cannot have me. It is very fucking dark. Oh, yes! Oh, I... See, I was trying to pay attention. I'm like, I bet there's one in this section. So what is that creature? Is it the god? Is it... It's the, the darkness of the world? I don't know. Things are very interesting. <laughs> you fucker. Bad fishy. Wah! Nice chance to ask it. Hey, hello, Mr. Eel. Are you the uh, evil incarnate or are you the dead god? Uh, Levi, they're not very talkative. Oh, I I can't spam out of this. <gasps> the turtle saved us, bro! <laughs> Let's fucking go! <laughs> oh, that was so cool! That was sick. Oh, so now we can swim out of here, yeah? Oh, I see it up there. 
How do I do it? Amalgamation of grief. It might be. So grief has been an emotion. Every time we've encountered that statue, our character has like curled up into a little ball and cried, like noticeably cried. So I'm assuming that grief, it like, it might be grief. This game has a profound melancholy to it. It's very beautiful, but very somber. I 100% agree, especially with the tones of the destroyed ruins and the, the destruction of the goddess. Something is clearly very wrong. And so I'm, I'm curious what that something is. Oh, so it lights up when we're close to it. Got it, got it. Yeah, even the music has this air of sadness to it. Like, are we sacrificing ourselves to put the world back together? Is our suffering returning life to this planet? Who knows? I'm very glad that I decided to play this this evening. Okay, if this is the same patch of... I'm going to shoot up to the right. No. No, you see? Ah, see, I remembered. So what gave it away, and again, incredible game design. I remembered seeing these butterflies down on the bottom floor. And so the fact that I couldn't see anything up in the top right. Oh, you can actually see something up there. Look, look, look. Very good game design. Showing us the section, having that little bit of terrain visible. Very, very cute. This this vibrated. Break? Yes. Again, a good thing with playing with the controller, there was a little vibration cue there. That I... I even though I didn't see the terrain, it still told me something was present. I think the shadow monster is supposed to be our innate fear of grief and our unwillingness to face it. I mean, we have only run from it. So that I would not toss out that interpretation. This girl used to be the goddess and she sacrificed her div divinity to save the planet. Now you're just having to come to terms with that. But the th so I don't agree with that. I think we're saving the planet because we restored substance. We restored plant life, we restored water, and now we've restored material. Like there's now spectral buildings. But also what's this stairway to heaven? But yeah, I don't think we're the goddess because if we were the goddess, I would, I, me, Geo, would have had the two entities look similar. We don't look anything like the goddess. Even our bo- I missed one! Fuck! Yeah, even our bodies are different shapes. Like, we have little stick- we have little nubbins. They're spectral, perhaps they're memories. An interesting thought. I mean, Levi, you might have a point. This might be the memory of what it used to be. God, I don't know, man. Oh, it needs the light to be solid. Interesting. Got it. That's why all the lanterns are here. To keep this place solid. <gasps> Yellow butterflies. Does it start to fade? Uh-oh. Oh, yeah, we're absolutely running out of time. Nope, I want it. I don't care. I'll go back for it. Oh, we can just jump on the building and just wait for it to fade. Got it. Hell yeah, boys! A secret! I'm so smart! What a pretty game, dude. Oh, that's cool. That's so cute. I like how it plays with the momentum. Yeah, like a good physics engine makes or breaks a platformer. So the fact that this handles well and just like is a joy to play, very good, top tier. Oh, uh, oh, oh, my brain does not enjoy this. I love gravity puzzles. Yeah, it's just enough to make your brain hurt a little bit. Oh, that's so cool. Because now we jump across and then we jump back. Oh, at some point I found birds. Oh, it was the 
probably the sound cue, Geo. You dummy. Boost. Jump. Nice. So boost. Jump back up. Oh, that's so clean. Dude, tight, good plat platforming is so yummy. Circle. Ooh, I like circles. Oh, I can sing. What does singing do? Oh, does it, it opens flowers. I like the indication of the AoE. That's super cute. I think we broke it, guys. Oh! Giant spider construct? Does he follow us? Oh! He's a friend! He thinks you're his mommy. <laughs> I wonder what the singing does to the shadow. That, I mean... My guess would be to bring it back to life. <gasps> Beetle construct! Thank you for the lift, friend. <gasps> another child! Another two children! Twins! Oh, got it! I can't quite jump over them, so I have to use them in tandem. <gasps> Sexy game design. All right, Levi, I, I, I screamed into the void and nothing happened. But let it be known that I tried. Oh, I'm glad I looked. Oh, it looks like there's one more section. Oh. The upside down is now the right side up. Oh, that's the pathway we've been building. So this is the main temple. Oh, we missed three. We did very poorly. Uh-oh! All right, we'll see if Levi's right. Does the singing soothe it and make it go away? Oh, sweet God. Oh, it's us. Yeah, that the face was very reminiscent of ours. The haircut was very reminiscent of ours. Okay, so this is the goddess statue. So we feel responsible? We failed the goddess, question mark? I'm assuming because we're inside of it, we can sing and have and soothe its grief. Oh, this is a tomb? Acceptance, fifth stage. Are we coming to terms with the loss of the 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 queen maybe it's not a god maybe it's a queen our mother maybe it's a mother daughter grief i i can only assume it's grief yeah i i don't know i don't know what the other woman is i know that the darkness looks like us which would indicate to me that it is somehow related to our person physically oh sing Oh, we can fix it. Cutscene. Oh my god.
So, it, it, it is a goddess? Because there doesn't seem to be a teeny tiny person in a tomb. Um, also, I, I, I don't know the relationship. Is it mother-daughter, or is it... Oh, I should have tried jumping, or I should have tried singing back to it. I don't know. Do we get to die in peace? Are we going to heaven? It... Yeah, we, we saved the world. There's We managed to expunge the darkness. Very cool. This legit made me tear up. It sounded amazing. I'm glad, man. Did we sacrifice ourselves to save the planet, and in return it spared you? Well, the darkness wasn't spared. The darkness was expunged. We were saved at the very end. We were dying. You you saw our character, like, coughing up, coughing the darkness out of her. And then we were re rewarded with eternal life. I, I would love to look up a, an interpretation of this game. My interpretation is that the goddess died and we felt responsible. And so we had to, we had to fix it. And because we saved the world and saved the goddess, we were allowed eternal life. They got to, they saved the world and they get to rest. I like having it open to interpretation, having the ability to take what you want away from it. There's nothing wrong with that. Wonder where the darkness came from? I think it's, I think it's our guilt because the face that it showed right when it consumed us was our own. It looked very similar to the main characters, the protagonist. It was an evil of our own making. And so that's why we feel responsible for the god dying somehow. I don't know. Thanks for playing. Oh, so cool. I love the concept art. Look at the little automaton things. There's a hug. The, the, the fact that there isn't a hug emote in this game with those little automatons is criminal.